Okay, so it's time for an abduction mission. Our first one. Good luck, troops. It's only moderate. 90 bucks is nice. We're going to Brasilia, Brazil. And we're just taking the top six again because all of our specialists are currently fatigued. And we even get Blue Ankylo in on the mission. I'm worried. I'm worried. So... Last time, I decided I think I'm just going to stick with the uh, grenades, laser sight combo. I don't think the medikit is going to make much difference on this early. And the chance to destroy cover and get an easy kill. Actually, flashbangs. Uh, flashbangs might be better. Depends on what we're going to fight. HE. How do I want to do this? Like an Ankylosaurus? Kind of like an Ankylosaurus. Alright, and because it's my own avatar... Uh... Where's the one I like? There we go. Alright. Um... I get to be the only off-color rookie on the on the squad. I think I gotta give a couple flashbangs this time. They're pretty good. So who's got like the worst aim? Actually, not bad. Apparently, I'm tied with worst. Okay, well, it's probably gonna be Enigma. Yeah. Okay, Enigma and Paul, you guys can have um, flashbangs. They're quite useful. You'll be a little bit less on the accuracy, but, uh, there we go. Okay, we got our six. We've got mostly grenades, a couple flashes, lots of, uh, laser sights. We'll see how we do. Straight Abduction watch. mission. It should probably be mostly thin, er, thin men. Hopefully not thin men. Hopefully mostly so sectors. Seeing as we can flash them, and then, then they'll just use mind spray instead of insta killing everyone. Our first mission was pretty brutal. Central, this is Big Sky. Strike team is touching down now. Standing by okay, I know this Roger area. Reading you five so, by five. normally on this Strike map, you would start over here, deployment. right? And today we start behind the, uh... Well, I guess kind of one of the observatory buildings, whatever it's called. Um... We might end up just, uh, lining up here. I think heading this way into the center is probably a bad idea. This looks to be one of my less enjoyable entry points, to be honest. Yeah, Reaper, I, I, I do know. I've looked at the stats and I've used them, so it's okay. Heading there now. So let's move along this direction. I try not to activate anything until we've got maybe into the building or something. On the move. It's kind of my plan for now. Headed there now. Maybe keep one person on the corner. You never know. <laughs> Alright, there's definitely sectoids. I heard that. This might activate. You never know. Looks like we're okay. So that's our normal landing point, landing zone. I definitely want to check inside this building. Roger that. If possible, we would go up. Isn't there a pipe? Or there's a ladder right there. I thought about going up the stairs, but I think the chance of uh, activating the middle would be bad. It would be too high. Roger that. On the move. And I'll just hang out behind the, the wall here. Maybe, yeah, sound ping. That's what I really wanted. So we got a little bit of a direction on where to go. And there's some meld, too. That's... I mean, last time we kind of failed the meld. Let's see how we do now. Okay, let's see. How do I want to do this? It's weird because we're in a... 
I've never come from this direction specifically before, so I don't, I don't know for sure how I want to go about this. Headed there now. Enigma can go have a look. If we don't activate anything, that's even easier. Affirmative. So we can just line up Headed on this wall now. for now. Moving the old rookie position. cuddle hug, group hug, whatever you want to call it. Moving. Now there is some. So we got some drones. At least we get some Overwatch, at one or two at least, I hope. Three drones? Alright, that's not too bad. Two drones, that's better. Whoever got that kill, thank you. Especially if it was me. Okay, now activating two pods on one turn is less good. Thank you, whoever got that kill. That's keeping my cool. Helping me keep my cool. Okay, that was, that was like, are you sure you're rookies? We just killed an entire pod on Overwatch. And, and a drone spare. All right, I say that was, that was good. Um, <laughs> okay, now what? Uh, Chuck Norris. Okay. Roundhouse kick to the drone. Oh, you can't see him. Well, we could just do the same thing again with overwatches. Yeah, Seeing as that last one worked so well. I won't be getting much melt, but... Uh, let's just back off. Well, Sandless, you're pretty pro. You can maybe take a shot. Nope, can't see a thing. Heading to that location. So any full cover left? Enigma, you get the most dangerous full cover spot. Move into position. Because, you know, you still can't be seen yet, so. Let's see how Overwatch works for number two. There's only two drones left, so. 0 for 2 on that one. Adjusting aim. Just don't shoot me. That's right, you shoot Sandler. Alright, so they both went out, so we didn't get a lot of overwatch. That one flew through the wall. Awesome. The more overwatch traps we can do, the better. That's pretty awesome. Now, some glass broke. I heard that in the background, so I assume there's another pod somewhere that's, like, patrolling around. Um... You know, I'm gonna make sure I get a kill. I'll, I'll take the first shot, just in case I get it. Oh yeah, look, I'm gonna be MVP watching. 39%, no problem. That just helps me guarantee to get a promotion, basically. Okay, next. Um, nothing else should be activated. We can reload and head towards the meld. I'm ready. I mean, this has been a pretty good mission to start with, I gotta say. You don't usually kill that many Heading aliens on Overwatch. Not in my go. experience, anyway. Oh, come on, Booster. I've got infinite lives on my character. On I'll just automatically reload whenever Blue Ankylo gets shot. <laughs> it's killing time. <laughs> I've got the magic button. Go hot, go hot. So, is this it? Just two more sectoids? Maybe if we just kill them quickly enough, we can get the meld. Alright, Enigma. Move up. They're not on Overwatch on turn one. Oh. 64% is not very good. But they are flanked. 75 is a little bit better. Okay, Chuck Norris. Come on. Oh, that hurts. Can't kill him if you don't I was know. really hoping we could kill both of these Ready in one turn. Location. I was also hoping Sandless could see from there. Well, maybe we can kill one. Enigma. We'll go for the less HP. Well. No, we can never throw a grenade far enough. Forget that. Alright, that's good. 
There's one left. Um, I guess I shouldn't rush it. I'm not going to be able to kill him on this turn, I don't think. Affirmative. I was just hoping that if I killed him right now, we could get all the meld before the end of the mission. But I don't Good think it's go. in the cards. So we'll just on? get some overwatches. Probably won't do anything, to be honest, but... He might run at us. I just I expect him to panic. They're falling back. Oh, there's another pod. Well, that's good. That, that means I made probably the right decision by not rushing it. All right. So now we got to. Well, see, yeah, I would, I would, if I could have killed everything, we would have got the meld. Seeing as that meld was again in a place you can't get to without flying. Man. Pretty brutal. So, we know there's um, sectoids like right along there. Maybe we, someone can chase that guy down. Like Sandless. If I push forward too much, we'll get flanked, is the trouble now. Moving to position. Jump through the window there. 30%, huh? What if I open that door? Still 30%. I was hoping you might get like better aiming angles from the other side. Oh, he's way back there. I, th I thought he was closer than that. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to take a 30% shot, to be honest. Concerned how we're gonna do this. It's only four sectoids. Can't really get close enough to help out. I would put Mr. Sandless here, but then that guy. Yeah, we're. And then it's half cover otherwise, so I think he holds still, honestly. Well, yeah, honestly. Probably okay here. You'll be fine, Blair. Do we take two 30% shots? I know there's no sapper, but let's see how much. See if we can get lucky and blow some stuff up. That was about a, as good as I could have expected for a, a non-sapper grenade. That was beautiful. It still only gave you 45%. Take it. Not good enough. Alright, well. The grenade was good, but I don't know if we've got enough shots to uh, make up for it. Alright, Riddleman. Come on, Enigma. Dang it! This is not the time to be missing. Position. Yeah, you can see from there. That's right. 65. Alright, we got one at least. Right. I haven't touched Overwatch stats, trust me. I have no idea what the actual uh, numbers are. I still don't know how much accuracy debuff Overwatch gives you. I'm expecting that other sector to cause problems now. One mind fray. Or not mind fray, mind meld. You know, the other mind. Uh, I thought that might happen. I was really hoping we could have killed these guys. Well, Blair, the good news is you're not dead. The bad news is you caused a panic chain that panicked half the squad. That's pretty bad. So, uh, you know, you could have done better, basically. My, my, if I, if there's any moral to the story, it's Blair. Try not to panic the squad next time. Solid copy. What did you miss, monster? Psh. You missed everything. Round. It's 
been a while since I've played with rookies, as you may be able to guess. Good thing blue is safe. Good thing blue is safe. Let's find out if there's the other sectoid over here. Not there. Sandus might have a shot from here. Maybe. Nope. Nope. Well, this will be interesting. Reaper, I will ban you. You know, I know you've been around for a long time, but seriously. No, that is not good. Look at that. Sandless doesn't even flinch. Um, so everyone's got their wits together again. Probably no one has the, uh ability to get around the flank here. Now he'll get half cover, but from point blank range, well, you know, I've got all these grenades. Here you go, Enigma. Toss a grenade in there. Good, you didn't even hurt him. That means we can get the kill on somebody without losing the uh, weapon fragments. So Blair, you know, I'm feeling generous. Seeing as you're the one that caused the horrible panic chain, you must kill one sectoid in recompense. Thank you. Okay, now it feels like all the meld canisters are probably gone again. We're not going to get a lot of ma meld in this new version of Long War. The way this is going, um, actual meld is... Like, I don't know how we're ever going to get any. They put them on the roofs now where you can't reach them. And this timing is still ridiculously short to get it. Probably should just reload a little bit. Sandless and Blue are going to deal with the last one. We'll be fine. Roger that. Mald. Malt. That's right. Malt. Oh, there he is. I thought he was... He must have gone... Run all the way through the building. Well, Blair... I'm sorry. What can I say? <laughs> Sectoids have incredibly good accuracy these days, ever since Beta 14. It makes it, uh, you know, a lot harder to keep you alive. Uh, at least you got a kill before you, uh, you know, you fell dead, dropped dead. Uh, I think uh, we're just going to back up behind this truck here and wait for it to come out. We we were almost we almost had this mission without any casualties. <laughs> it was close. I'm on the move. Heading out. All right, everyone's in position. We started with Overwatch. Let's end with. We started with Overwatch. I wanted to fin finish with Overwatch. Well, you're never gonna hit him from there. The fact that you can see him is probably the problem. You need to be somewhere that you can't see him, so he can't see us. And that'll make him come out. Got a lot of How can you me. see us? I thought... See, this doesn't make sense. How can the sectoid see me and take a shot when we don't even know where he is? Do they have extra vision over what we get? Roger, tracking. Come on, Sectoid. I'm not losing any more people. I'm not losing any more soldiers today. There he is. Kill him. Okay, Sadless, that's alright. You can miss once in a while. Alright, he probably dashed, right? Yeah. Okay, you know what this is time for? This is Blue Vengeance time. I'm on the move. Yeah, that's right, I got a crit. Chalk up another one. <laughs> ah, well, we lost our first name soldier. It's pretty brutal. Alright. So how come you guys got your kills? You didn't get any promotions out of it. That's not very nice. 
Oh, it looks like I'm gonna be a sniper then, huh? Uh, I may hit random for myself just to uh, to give it more total luck. Now, nah, of course, blue gets uh, a good shot. Please reincarnate, I suppose. Um, pull. We have one assault and we have one infantry so far. Um, but the infantry is currently wounded. Uh, HP low, average aim. You can be infantry. There you go. And then me, myself, what do I want? I don't know. I know I don't have any scouts yet, but I don't have that great mobility. And also, scouts always die. Squad site, we already have a sniper. I'll be, you know what, I'll be a scout. I'll be fair. There we go. I am a scout. I will probably die instantly now. So, abduction mission, you don't get a whole lot of rewards, obviously. We will be in touch, Commander. So someone wanted a resurrection, I suppose. I suppose I could do that. I can be nice. So we'll give him the next slot down. Who was it that died? Blair Kinsella, I believe. I guess I could check the memorial. Seeing as we got people here on the actual live stream, it's fair. Two kills! These guys didn't count. <laughs> Plasma pistol. Yeah, you're gonna see this a lot more in Beta 14. This is not something people died to very often in Beta 13. Not if you're actually in cover. Bowsers. I'll resurrect Blair. I feel like that's okay. I need more names anyway, so might as well. So you went from whatever you used to have to this. You're one of the more will willpowery soldiers. All right. Well, let's see what happens next. If people can finish being fatigued first or not. Got to get more specialists promoted is really the current goal. Norman Deke. I could write that down. Let me get the mission to the next one so that I can cut the video for YouTube. Oh wait, I forgot one thing. Two aircraft. I want two Stingray missiles. And I forgot to rename these guys. And I suppose if I'd been a little if I'd been like a day quicker, I should have done this. I should have put a couple satellites up for uh for the end of the month. Just for uh Europe. We get more missions if we can see all of Europe, and it's actually good, seeing as we've already got uh, air cover. Yeah, yeah. Well, wait, no, no, I forgot. I forgot completely about part of the game. I never even looked at this. Ha ha ha! It's been a while since I've started over, obviously. So this is our facility map, right. How do I want to do the facilities? How are we going to sort this out? I totally forgot. Um, I don't like having steam right here because I can't do a good satellite uplink block that's dumb or else I lose the steam um, labs are cheaper I uh, theoretically could get a lab and a workshop going relatively early yeah this is like the worst layout I've seen probably I do like free um, dugout bottom areas because it saves you the most money but man, I don't know do I just start another uplink right away I pretty much dang I don't know if I'm just gonna lose that steam vent because I need a 3 by 2 area for uplinks start digging there anyway I don't know what I'm gonna do I'll actually start this lift too Oh, I haven't decided what I'm going to do with that yet. We'll see. We'll let a little bit of time go by for my brain to sort it out. Another abduction Commander, mission. Commander, we're tracking several reported abductions via the Hologlobe. I've got the coordinates locked in. Extra Life Stream Group? It is Get Day, or sorry, Get Waved is the name of the group. 
because Get Daved and Snap Wave were the people that I used to watch when I got into Extra Life, so I joined their group. Uh, so we got an abduction mission. I'm going to put a cut in the video here, and we'll figure out who I'm going to bring.